Hey what's up guys this is Push to Insanity and what you're watching today is another free intro template tutorial. So go ahead and open up the download file that you should have gotten from the description of the video. And you'll notice that you're provided with the font that was used in the intro template, the After Effects file, and the Cinema 40 file. You guys are also provided the background.mp4 file which is a file that I provide um, to people that don't have the plugins that were used to create the background effect. I don't think any other uh, channels do this, so it's something that's pretty exclusive to my channel. And I'm going to think of other stuff to help people that don't have plugins to use templates. So now go ahead and install the font if you guys haven't already and open up the Cinema 4D part of the intro. Over the ocean waves and try to come to life. So now to edit your first text, select both mo bottom mode text objects and change your text to whatever you want. Do the same thing for your second text. You guys can also change the size and the font of the text. Once you've finished editing your text, go to your render settings and save your intro to your own desktop or folder and you guys can render out your Cinema 40 part of the intro. Once you have downloaded the cinema, once you have finished rendering the Cinema 40 part of the intro, open up your After Effects file. Try to leave your fears behind. We are locked in an orbit facing ground. You'll notice that you're missing um, a file, which is the actual intro template render. So to fix this, just right-click where it says Free Intro and replace the footage with what you just rendered in Cinema 4D. So if you guys did it in a PNG sequence, open up the first picture which should be the one of four zeros and make sure that PNG sequence is selected. So if you guys already have the plugins that were used to create the background, you'll notice that the background will already appear. But if you guys don't have these plugins, the background will not be appeared for you guys and you guys will not have the background that was used in the template. So um, to fix this, I provided you guys with the background.mp4 file that I do for pretty much all my intros now. Um, this, is for the, this is for people that don't have the plugins that were used to create this background. So all you gotta do is just import it and drag it right under your Cinema 4D render and you guys will get that background effect without having those plugins that were used to create it. Once you guys have finished editing your After Effects, go to Composition and add your composition to the render queue and you guys can render out your intro.